the plotter was an interesting challenge and one that uh, everybody was pretty excited about. Welcome to the Magic Series, where Hollywood filmmakers share their magic with you. In this episode, we feature Simon Jung and Dennis Yu, the VFX supervisor and animation supervisor on The Last of Us, made possible by AIS and Simpty, Dell Technologies, and NVIDIA. We initially rebuilt the bloater as he was captured in camera on the day, but it quickly turned out that we had to free up the performance. As that came up, it also became clear that um, we want to change the design of him a little bit. We want to make him, you know, a, a little bit more muscular, a little bit taller, a little bit more defined in the um, in his head shapes. Things that you just couldn't do with a prosthetic suit because you're limited by the um, by the human physique a little bit or by the character that's inside of that suit. So we changed. Basically everything. We changed the uh, uh, materials on him because, you know, once we had the, uh, the the design freed up, we were also free to change the materials. So we we were able to add more uh, wetness to him, make him look a little bit more slimy. You know, he has uh, different hair growth through his uh, cordyceps crown. So everybody that worked on this character had a lot of fun with it, and um, and uh, it it really shows in the end. I think it's a, he's a pretty iconic uh, character in the end. I think one of the References that I like that they gave, um, I think Craig Mason pulled this out, I'm not entirely sure, but Alex Wang brought it up where he, he showed us the picture of a MMA fighter. I think it was Tank Abbott. And they're like, can we make him look like this? He's really big, and but also athletic and could beat the crap out of you. <laughs> this was a trailer shot. So it was the first time the world was introduced to this character. And uh, it was very important to everybody to, um, to Craig Mason and Alex, as well as us, to make this look as as good and as menacing and as incredible as possible. We basically freed up the entire plate and made this an all CG shot because we knew that we had to place our uh, fires in a very specific way so it frames the bloater nicely and it silhouettes him nicely. And we wanted to have our um, infected come out in a very specific way so um, we scrapped the ones that were in the plate and just basically turned that into the shot that it was like that. His hand uh, crushes a little bit of dirt on the way up so to give him some, some nice weight. And yeah, that along with the with the atmospherics on the on the ground made for this really really moody shot that um, was ultimately also very well received. I loved when that first came out, and you know Craig Mason was saying it's gonna break the internet, and kind of almost did. So it's pretty awesome. <laughs> the Magic Series presented by AIS and Simpty, Dell Technologies, and Nvidia. Look for more episodes of the Magic Series coming soon.